Uh... Hey everyone, I'm Bro Ryan the Not Star Hog. And I am Orion the Horrendously Confused. What am I looking at? Hold it! What you're looking at past me is quite arguably the most pixelated thing you've ever put out. I can't even read this while re-editing it. I normally don't do this, but this one is going to get a re-record and fixes to the actual gameplay footage so it's visible. There. Now commence with the party planning. This is a game that uh, I happened to notice on a blog called Sonic Positive, who reblogged the my post on Tumblr for the Sonic OC Showcase when we're going to do our Forces Let's Play. And I also happened to notice this game right underneath that post that said, Sonic the Hedgehog Party Planner. And I thought to myself, oh, it's a click and choose your own adventure game, huh? Okay, so let's see. Is it a beta? Is it a what? But nope, it's been fully completed, and this game was created by, I can't remember the name, it says it right here. I'm trying to read it, because Orion has the wrong screen up. Okay, it's at Platonic Carmani, or at least that's what it says here. There's other names on Tumblr, and we'll be sure to put up a screenshot of that screen right there. So, these are the ones responsible for this game, and I thought to myself, well... We need to fill up some time before Forces comes out, and I figured, why don't we just make up a party before Eggman blows the whole world up? Why can't I help but feel like this is revenge for the Henry Stickman games, in, oh. a, in a mild sense? In, in a way, it could be considered uh, revenge for the Henry Stickman games. You threw me right into a situation where I had no idea what I was doing, and now I'm going to do the same to you. Granted, I don't know what's going to go on either. I have no idea what's going to happen in this game, but based on what I saw from the Tumblr page, it looks like it could be pretty interesting. So we're going to give this thing a go. So go ahead and hit play. All right, so what's your name? Your name is... Orion. Oh, you don't have to put Orion. Well, you could actually. You could. Hello, Orion the Starhog, but not as like a. Oh, uh, not like my username. Yeah, I. You are Orion the Starhog. Wait, the doesn't have a capital letter. Just. Like, just well, I mean, I am the only one I, I'm aware of. No, 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 no. no. Uh, whatever. It's like the Starhog. No. Okay. Sonic the Hedgehog Party Planning Simulator 2017. Welcome to Sonic Party Planning Simulator 2017, Orion the Starhog. Maybe I should have just gone with Orion. For maybe, just maybe. Sake. Every year, Sonic plans an amazing birthday party for Tails, and Tails wants to repay the favor. Well, that and Sonic always throws way better parties than Tails, which is a slight on Tails' honor. That's why he needs your help, Orion the Starhog. Oh boy. He's already done all the grunt work, enlisting friends to help gather party supplies, ordering the cake, but Sonic is nosy and suspicious, so it's your job to keep Sonic distracted and control any emergencies that may crop up. Tails wants this to be a surprise party, so Sonic needs to be kept away from friends and from the Mystic Ruins. Additionally, Eggman is causing a bit of trouble around the world, and as luck would have it, Sonic has stitches from his last run-in with the evil mastermind. Stitches? What happened? Who injured him? Okay, anyway. <clears throat> As a result, he can't fight him unless he wants to start bleeding profusely. Ew. Whoa. What? Did this, you read I didn't, any of this I didn't, before we began? I didn't expect the party planning simulator to be so dark. Right? <laughs> okay, so it's up to Tails to stop Eggman from his command center. Missiles are your friend, as it turns out. It's up to you whether you take on Eggman, running the risk of letting Sonic wander off without guidance, or you let Eggman attack and gain power. If he gets too strong, however, there will be no stopping him, so tread carefully. I, 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 okay, when I heard party planner, I didn't think it was going to be juggling objectives. It's like, Apparently am I playing a party planner or am I playing Pikmin where I have to negotiate with three different things at once? What the heck? This game looks like it's going to be a lot more involved than just picking and choosing the right answer. So There's going to be a lot involved. I'm impressed already if it turns out the way I think it will. I'm terrified if it's turning out the way I think it will because I'm very bad at messing this kind of stuff up. That means you're really good. What? You said you're very bad at messing stuff up. See? I'm already so terrified, my speech ain't working so good. <laughs> Let's look at the tutorial then. Okay, this is both a fan game and a story. So the gameplay is text-based, but there is an interface-like system that is designed to help you as you move forward. This tutorial will help explain the gameplay and the interface. Alright, so let's see. There's a to-do list, and there's a map. Monopole, Empire City, Central City, Crush Canal. Righteous! Station Square, Westopolis, Gun HQ, United Federation. The United Federation. Okay. Um, so there's a to-do list. That Okay, so this is the command center. Amy has to get this. Knuckles got to get this. Silver and Blaze, Rouge, Vector, Cream, SBO. 
Oh, looking for Mighty and Ray. Must be like a big reunion thing. Okay. So, this is the command center, yeah. Main screen shows the map. Small is the view screen for when Tails gets a call from a buddy and the list below that keeps track of all the friends on your journeys, okay? Map will zoom in as Sonic moves around the planet and the to-do list will also change with relevant information. So make sure you pay attention to your command center. So, this is going to be where everything happens. All right. Let's see. This is the map of the world. Oh, my God. There's more than just that. Oh, my God. Wow. What did you just throw me into? I don't know. It's a lot bigger than I thought it would be. I'm impressed. Okay. So this is the map of the world. It shows where Sonic and his friends currently are. It also shows the available places where Sonic can move to. Sonic can easily run across the water, even though he has stitches. So traveling from continent to continent is not an issue. It will change to suit the situation, often zooming in in order to allow you to see finer details. This map will also show Eggman's movement when he becomes a problem. But wait, he can run across the water at supersonic speed with his stitches, but if he fights Eggman, he'll start bleeding profusely? I don't freaking know. <laughs> How convenient. Okay, um... Game uses three point systems to keep track of your progress and decide which ending you should get. Party points is the PP, suspicion points is the SP, and egg points is the EP. Party points are used to determine how good of a party Tails throws at the end of the game. The more PP, the better. Suspicion points represent how suspicious Sonic is of Tails. The closer he gets to 25, the closer he gets to figuring out that there's a surprise party. If he figures it out, the game is over. Okay, well, I mean, I guess that makes okay, sense. So, the whole so... point is that Tails wants it to be a surprise. <clears throat> but at least there's no, like, oh, you... I, I, th I don't think that's there to, like, penalize you if it's higher up when the party happens. Because even if Sonic is suspicious, that tells me that, oh, okay, well, he didn't exactly know. So I think we'll be we'll be able to get away with that. Okay, if you figure it out, game's over. Egg points are used to determine how much power influence egg and in power how much power and influence Eggman has gained. If he gets to ten EP, this game is over because there is no way to stop him. Ten? That's it? You gotta keep an eye on Eggman. Why don't I just shoot my foot and go to Honolulu? Like, wow! This is I'm I'm terrified. Like I'm gonna lose. First chance, I'm guaranteeing you, I'm going to lose. Well, let's just see what all this is all about. Okay, so let's play. All right. Oh my God, it's a it's a it's a, it's a, it is it is a fan fiction. Ugh. All right. So Tails is sitting in a darkened room in the workshop with a headset over his ears. In front of him is a computer screen and a list of all of his friends. Currently, Sonic is downstairs stretching for a run, and Tails is prepared to send him away so that he can finish planning for his party. Don't stretch too much or you'll snap your stitches. <clears throat> right now, ten of Sonic's friends are flung to all corners of the world, collecting world-class supplies for a one-of-a-kind party. At least in Tails' opinion. Tails must keep track of where they are so he can keep Sonic away from them. Okay, so he's got Knuckles in this, Amy's doing this, Cream, Silver, okay, ba 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 I mean, I need a piece of, I need a piece of paper, I need to write all this stuff yeah, down. Yeah, like, we need to strategize everything here. <laughs> Like, if we just start clicking stuff, we're going to lose, like, in five minutes. Here, you you get to keep notes. You're, you're the wiseacre who thought this would work. You get to keep notes. Okay, I'm going to keep Knuckles notes. Knuckles is in Monopole. Amy's in Spagonia. Cream and Vanilla are in Green Hill. What are you doing? Start writing. I don't know I, how long this is going to stay on screen. I would. It's still here. Look, see, it's on the to-do list. All that's just the to-do list. Okay, Silver and blazer and zero mobile. party points, zero submission points, and zero egg points. All right. Okay. Uh, wait. So we're gonna have to do like voicing and stuff. Mm. Oh. All right. Okay. I can. I can do my tails voice. Everybody loves my tails voice. Apparently. Yeah, I'm noticing. I noticed that in the mania comments. Like, I had one comment where he's like, "You're gonna do the whole ending with tails voice, right?" It's like, uh, <laughs> no. Okay. So let's see. Um. Hmm. So. Tails. Okay, who, I know. Who's, I'm who's just gonna, trying to. I'm who, trying to figure out which one of us has a better Sonic voice. What I'm gonna wonder is if Cream ends up talking. Well, that's easy. That's no big deal. I can do that. <laughs> okay. Hey, Tails! I'm leaving. Sonic calls, and Tails can hear a door open. I'm on comms. It slams shut. The headset over Tails' ears crackles, and Sonic's voice comes from with barely a pause. Who needs my help first, buddy? Where should Tails send Sonic? Uh, let's see. Central City, there's a fire. There's a cat stuck in a tree. Monopole, Tails needs a new hoverboard part. Okay. So Monopole's a bad idea. Knuckles is in there. Okay, so wait. Hang on, hang on, hang on. So, let's see. Let's look up at the, let's look at the map again. So, is anybody in Central City? Uh, Central City, that'd be down here. 
Who, who's in Central City? Is there anybody there? Green Hill, Mobile Tropolis, No. Park, and Adabat. Okay, so they are... So they're... There's nobody in Central City. Gun HQ, there's nobody in Gun HQ. Okay, but that's a really stupid thing, because if... A, a cat like, stuck, in cat a stuck in a tree at Gun and, HQ. is nobody... compared to fire. It's not even that. It's like... Like, Sonic's gonna be like, wait a second, there's a cat stuck in a tree and you're sending me to go help the gun agents? Like, they don't have, like, a ladder? <laughs> Okay. Tails needs a new hoverboard part. Is there anybody in Monopole? Knuckles. Yeah, Knuckles in Monopole. Okay, so I guess the best thing we can do here is we need to go to Central City and send them to go put out that fire. And go to Central City. Da -da -da -da. All right. Sonic arrives on the scene of a massive fire blazing in downtown. He runs up a nearby building and launches himself into the blaze through an open window. A few frantic seconds pass, and then Sonic comes hurtling out, cradling an angry bundle of fur. It hisses and scratches at him, but he grins and holds it up for a firefighter to take. You've got quite a spirit, buddy! Sonic cries as the cat is taken away. Oh, meet up by Ansel. There was already a cat stuck in a tree anyway, or was it in a building? Ah, whatever. It's still a cat. There actually was a fire, and Sonic got to hold a cat. His suspicion stays, stays the, the same. same. Okay. Is uh, I think that's a good thing. Okay, wait, wait, wait. You didn't click. Oh, God. Oh, wait. Was there anything else to click on? Yes, the continue button. Okay, I didn't know if there was something to scroll down on. Okay, so Amy's. Now we got Amy on the screen. A loud ringtone blares from the command center speakers, and Amy's face appears on screen. Tails quickly answers, keeping one eye on Sonic as he explores. So, we might have a problem, Amy declares without a single second's hesitation. They put the wrong, wrong name, name on, on the, the cake. cake. Tails feels his heart stop for a second. What's it say? Maybe it's salvageable. Sunky. Amy says without a hint of <laughs> irony. <laughs> what? <laughs> Wait, let me... Okay, I'll try. What? Holds the cake up in front of the camera, and there it is. Perfect curly script without a hint of irony. Sunky. What should I do? Tails has to make a decision, and he has to make it now. What should he tell Amy? Okay, so keep we it, have an option. Send it keep, back so, or fix it So himself. if we keep it, the cake says Sunky. If we send it back, it's going to take too long to make a new cake. Fix it herself. Amy's good in the kitchen, right? Like, that's freaking canning. She knows how to cook and stuff. She can handle that. Oh, boy. So. Fix it. Tell Amy to fix it! Fix it yourself! Tails replies, twitching as Sonic starts to get antsy and texts him a few times. You want me to scrape off the icing? Do what you have to do. Tails says, grim. Amy is very capable in times of stress and she does an admiral job. Booyah! I told you! As, as long, long as, as Sonic, Sonic doesn't, doesn't squint at the cake, cake. <laughs> never notice. The party points remain the same, so we... So it's still zero? So we screwed up. No, we didn't. Amy does a good job, so as long as Sonic don't, doesn't squint, she fixed it! But don't you think the party points should have gone up for this? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't get it. Whatever. We'll, we'll, we'll see what happens. Continue. Oh, boy. Okay. <clears throat> zero party points, zero suspicion Nothing's points. Nothing's happened. Zero egg points. Okay. So I think we're starting to get the hang of this. We can logic our way through this game. Or so we think. Okay, so where should Tails send Sonic next? Um, casino Park. Someone's trying to rob a casino, but Rouge is in there. Okay, so... Westopolis. The aliens are attacked. Freaking what? <laughs> Westopolis was only shown so we're going, in one game. We're so going we're doing to Shadow West the Hedgehog Westopolis again. for the eleventh time. <laughs> well, actually, no. It's our first time. We haven't done. Shadow we haven't the done Hedgehog. Shadow the Hedgehog yet. Okay. Um, and Glyphic Canyon. Glyphic Canyon. There was a rock slide. Um. Okay. Wait. So. So. But this, this is the thing that bugs me. There actually was a fire, is what it said. So is Tails lying to Sonic? I don't think so. And he's just getting lucky? Okay. So, Westopolis. The, there's no, is there anybody in Westopolis? No. I don't think so. At, Atabat, Green Hill, Grand Metropolis, Casino Park, Mobotropolis, and Monopole. Okay. And Amy's in Spagonia, so Amy's no. in Spagonia, Westopolis, Glyphic Canyon. Nobody's in the Glyphic Canyon. Okay, but here's the thing, though. We're, we're, this is the part we're ignoring. This is how close Sonic can get to things. So, where is Sonic now? He went to... We sent him to... I don't think he's on this this map. No, he's not. I did, we didn't send him to Station Square. We didn't send him to Westopolis either. He wasn't at the Gun HQ. No, we sent him to stop a fire. Uh, I don't know. Okay. Use um, the notebook! I gave it to you for a reason! Sonic in... Uh, Sonic in... Uh. Okay, so I'll just start putting where Sonic is then. Alright, so Sonic... Okay, the safest place I think... Oh, wait a minute. Hang on a second. If we say the aliens are attacking again and they're not, Sonic's gonna get suspicious. Um, 
Well, I mean, is it going to deliberately lie to us and say, Oh, the aliens are attacking again? It's like, oh wait, psych! That, that would kind of be a jerkish move by the game. Okay, um, I vote we send him to the Glyphic Canyon. There was a rock slide. That's believable. Sonic arrives in Glyphic Canyon and asks around. Oh, crap! Sonic arrives in Glyphic Canyon and asks around, but he can't find any evidence that there was a rock slide today. He radios and informs Tails. You sure you got a report on a rock slide, bud? Because I've got nothing! It's, it's probably an old report! Tails says quickly, hoping that Sonic will interpret his panic as something less suspicious, like maybe annoyance or uneasiness. May okay. Maybe, Sonic replies, and Tails breathes out a sigh of relief. Rock slides are kind of common here. It's understandable that Tails might have outdated information, so Sonic's suspicion stays the same. Okay, we got lucky. Okay, so we, we sent... got lucky! Sonic... <laughs> Sonic at Glyphic Canyon. Yeah. Keep going. Glyphic Canyon. Canyon. Uh-oh. It's Knuckles. Oh, God. Okay, but that means we're going down the list as we go. So Amy got the cake. We're done with Amy. All are right. You, are you sure she's still not in Spagonia, though? She might have moved. Okay, we'll see. <sighs> The phone rings again, and Tails picks up with a bit of panic because Sonic is already getting antsy. Of course he is. Just, just, it's stand still for like two minutes. This isn't Sonic Boom Sonic. He's gonna move. <laughs> Knuckles' face materializes, and at first he's holding the screen too close, so Tails gets a good nice view of his teeth, but then he figures it out and pulls it back. What's wrong? Tails asks because that's the only reason Knuckles would ever be caught dead using his communicator. <laughs> I don't have money. Knuckles responds in that gruff Knuckles way of his. What do I do? Of course he doesn't have money. He lives on an island that floats and doesn't have a legal tender or a need for it. How did they both, in conjunction, forget that? What should Tails tell Knuckles to do? Okay, Knuckles is getting plates and forks and monopole. Okay, so that's what he's getting. Use the credit card I give you. Steal, steal it. it. <laughs> that, no, that, that would already cause problems. Knuckles, n n no. Tails. It's like, yeah, that, he's gonna, I'm gonna, we're going to do the dark side and we're going to make it steal it. We're going to go down the badness level. Nah. I'm gonna go down the dark side. Or talk him through working in it. Use That's gonna take card. forever. Credit use the card. credit card. I gave you a credit card. Tails remembers. Use that. Do I like hand it to the guy or? Knuckles, have you ever bought anything before? No. Knuckles grits back. I was born on an island in the heavens. The blood of. Yeah, I get it. It flows inside you. Just hand the card to the guy, and we'll handle it. Sure. Yes, I bought things a lot. Knuckles glares at him and hangs up. The transaction goes smoothly, and Knuckles gets out of there with minimal trauma. Party gains two points. Okay, yes! so getting the, using the credit card was, in fact, the right option. Well, trying to walk him through doing the, the ATM. ATM would have been a... Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> to do this, deal with this. Okay. <laughs> I know that's... I know it's dirty, but, like, all of a sudden, it's just like, scrub the to-do list, deal with this! <laughs> <laughs> and now we have to make sure we can't send Sonic to wherever Eggman is, or there he'll start to bleed profusely. Oh, my God. Okay. Where are the missiles? An alarm blares from everywhere at once, and Tails nearly curses as he scrambles to turn it off. On the screen, a bright red warning flashes. Tails flings through a few screens to pull up the news aggregate program he constantly has running. Oh, it categorizes every little piece of news media from around the world, tossing out the junk and grouping things that might require his attention. When something major happens, it triggers the Eggman alarm, and this time is looking to be a typical run-of-the-mill problem. I ha okay, so that's, by the way, that's a very brilliant algorithm that Tails has running. Anyway, <clears throat> the first heading is simple. Mysterious deforestation and frog forest. Eggman to blame? No, that would be Deforestator from Lilo and Stitch. <laughs> Anyway, he absolutely is cutting down trees. Tails decides as he flips through more. There's a direct video from a hiker in the forest, and the local government is already scouring the area in a panic. The problem is Sonic can't help. He has stitches up his side, and he can't be fighting robots. It's up to Tails to stop the deforestation, or Eggman will have valuable resources. But there's another hitch. If Tails stops paying attention to Sonic, he might roam and run into someone. But it's a risk Tails is willing to take. What should Tails do? Oh, Ooh, geez. this is okay, bad. Let's see. Okay, so Tails. The, clo the closest so danger is Casino Park. That's where, Sh but Shadow and Rouge are still there. Right. But at the same time, Eggman and no. Okay, Wait. so he's getting wood, right? Like, what's he gonna do with wood? It's not like a. It's not like a power supply. You're. I. I don't know. I don't know. See, it's. 
Okay, Shadow and Rouge in Casinopolis. I mean, what was it that Shadow and Rouge were doing again? They were getting... Well, it doesn't really matter what they were getting at this point, because you said it yourself. They're still there. I mean, Casinoopolis isn't a horrible place to find Rouge, right? Like, that's pretty normal for her. I... Like, she's a thief. She wants money. That's what she does. With Shadow with her? Okay, where's Shadow? Shadow's not a thief. He's crazy sometimes, but he's not a thief. Shadow's not crazy. Ah, if it was just Rouge, it wouldn't be so bad, but the Shadow thing But the fact that Shadow is there is throwing a wrench into the works. Well, what do we do? Mm, I would like to know your idea. I say stop him. Then run the risk of like, Sonic. Who stops him? Tails? Tails. So Tails is going to run out to wherever Eggman is. Stop him. And, and stop him himself and fly back. Apparently. Okay, let's stop him then. Eh. Target blocked. Oh, it's the missiles. Oh, what? Uh oh. Tails fires off missiles and hacks. Oh, oh the missiles, that's right. Ah. And he ran into Charmy. Hacks Eggman's Egg computers to get his robots to grind to a halt. This is completely decimates Eggman's deforestation robots, and he flees. Eggman's influence drops significantly. But he already had zero! Oh, crap! We done goofed. I didn't know that's how that worked. I thought it was more like a, it, it, keeps it, it keeps going up, going up until... and it stays there, not goes back down. Oh, man. Unfortunately, Sonic wanders off and runs into Charmy and Grand, Grand Metropolis. Metropolis. What? Wait, he, he skipped. He I ran thought, all the way there, yeah. I thought he would go to the next area over, not just jump all the way over. I guess he didn't want to go to Casino Park. Okay, uh, Charmy is buzzing down the sidewalk, looking bored but placated. So Sonic zips up to him. Hey, Charmy, what's up? Uh, oh, hey, Sonic! Nothing much! Vector's being boring, so I'm taking off on my own! Is that a good idea? Aren't you, like, six? Yeah, what of it? It's not safe for a kid your age to go out alone. You should at least have a map! Charmy oh. sighs and kicks his little feet. Well, Vector's getting a present for you, you know. Maybe I should go find him. See ya! It happens almost too fast for Sonic, and Charmy zooms off. Sonic's Sonic suspicion, suspicion rises a bit. Oh, no. Okay. How much is a bit? It's... Oh, one. One. Okay. We ha Wait a minute. If it only goes up by one and the max is 25, how long is this thing? I guess Charmy did it so quickly that it didn't even matter.